All right, um, the uh, JPI EDM 790 has just been installed on my airplane. Um, I haven't seen many of these around. Um, and I'm hoping to upload this video so that somebody considering something like this will know what to expect. Okay, put the Dynamix on and just look at that guy just fly right up. That is much better. Uh, the hub's hours are obviously not correct, but this is obviously an improvement over the JPI 760 analog type. So, yeah, let's see if I can grab that old one to show you what that looks like. This is the old one that just came out of it. It's the old 760. Standby, the display will start to go off, go out on me. And quite frankly, having to cycle through all the buttons by pushing this step button, it's getting kind of old. So I um, upgraded it, cost me about a thousand bucks, pending my returning of this, otherwise it's thirteen dollars extra. So as you can see, the wires just plug in right here, and it's actually plugged in play with that one. So. I'm actually, for such a large instrument, it's actually pretty light, which I guess is part for the course in aviation. Put this away. And let's see if this guy's uh, in right there. Without having to push any buttons, you can get all 12 cylinder indications. EGT is up at the top in blue, and CHT is in the bottom. Look at that, I still got the little wrapper on it. I haven't even taken that out yet. So, this is what it's supposed to look like. Alrighty. Okay, alright. Signing off.